I'm Bettina Schindelke. I'm the product manager for EFOI Pro Series and Energy Solutions. And we're the company SFC Energy AG. Who is SFC? It should be here. We are a group existing of uh, three uh, companies. Uh, the headquarter is in uh, Germany. We're based uh, south of Munich. Um, the other two companies, uh, one is Cymark. It's uh, based in Canada. And uh, they are in the oil and gas industry. And uh, PBF is our third uh, company. They're doing power supplies, and they are in Netherlands and Romania. But the key fact on this slide is we have 41,000 fuel cells in the market right now. We're in different markets. I have to have a little bit of uh, technical problems here. <laughs> yes. Um, so we're in uh, three different markets. Um, now we're talking about the industry market. So uh, this is the EFOI Pro series. Uh, we have uh, one system uh, with 45 or 110 watts and a bigger one with a 19 uh, inch rack uh, possibility with 500 watts. And uh, brand new, we also have a hydrogen version um, with 2.5 kilowatts. Um, we're also in the de defense market and the security market. There we have also an around 120 watt system. It's an onboard uh, fuel cell and portable solutions, these two with 25 and 50 watt. Um, and where we started is the consumer market. So this means with recreational vehicles and boats. So leisure market. Um, but now we're talking about industry. So which markets do we uh, go there? It's very widespread. So we're in the wind market. Uh, CCTV is a very growing market now. Um, also environmental sensors and telecom backup. So everything is possible. Just imagine about where you don't have a grid, then think about our fuel cell. OK, this was too much. Just a second. Yes, here. SFC is not only a fuel cell developer, producer, and distributor. We're also doing the complete package. So we're doing the components right, uh, right around of the fuel cell. So we source them and bring you a whole package. So we do also system integration. This is called for us the energy solutions. And we do also service around. So all our fuel cartridges, we do a worldwide logistics for them. And the complete package goes to the customer. But what wants the customer? The customer is asking for power. He wants very efficient and reliable systems. He wants it anywhere and anytime. So we have a lot of different requirements. And he wants his power source immediately, and this means plug and play. He wants to take the solution, go to the side, plug in his uh, load, and go. And everything should be running fine. He also wants a continuous off-grid, and this for months, and of course, weather independent, so all over the world, uh, equal if in winter or in summer. And yes, everyone wants it's a low operating and low service costs. And our fuel cell fulfill all these requirements. Just a second. Here it is. So what are we doing in the energy solutions? We take our fuel cell. It's a methanol fuel cell. Um, we have cartridges up to 60 liters. So you just take your cartridge, your fuel cell, and this is connected to the battery. The fuel cell only switches on if it's needed. So it controls the battery voltage, and if it's needed, then it switches on. If it's not needed, it doesn't switch on. We have the best solution in combination with solar panels. Then it's a hybrid system. You can see it here on this diagram. Uh, the dark gray line is the load demand of the customer. The light gray line is the power output from the solar panel. And you can see that in the winter months and also in bad weather situations, the solar panel has a gap between the power output and the demand of the customer. So in, these will be covered off the fuel cell. So the, the green bars are the fuel consumption of the EFOI. 
So if you take solar panel and an EFI, you have the best system. You have 100% reliability and you can minimize your fuel consumption. Okay. <laughs> ah. But why methanol? Methanol is a very lightweight and high energy density liquid. So we have, as I said, canisters or tanks uh, up to 60 liters. A 10 liter canister only weighs around 8.5 kilograms, so everyone can carry it. And in 10 liters, we have 11.1 kilowatt hours. So if you have a uh, demand of uh, power for 50 watt continuous, then you can power it up with two 28 liter canisters for 50 days. And this is only with the EFO. If you combine this with a solar panel, it's much longer. And in the beginning, I said that we're not only doing the fuel cell, <laughs> we're doing the energy solutions round about it. What does it mean? Energy solution, as I said already, we, take, we need a battery, we need the canisters, we need sometimes solar charge controllers and electronic devices from the customer. So we want it in one box, one shelter, one cabinet, whatever the customer wants. So we have a standard repertoire of uh, these. So we have a ProCube. This means an aluminum box. You can take it very easily. It's a very cheap uh, solution. Um, and it's more or less for a temporary, and temporary uh, solution, but it's very po portable. Our other portable uh, solution is the EFOR Pro Energy case. Uh, it's, a, it's a plastic box instead of an aluminum box uh, with wheels on it. So more portable than the EFOIL Pro Cube, but also less autonomy because we only have two 10 liter canisters inside. This one we have on our booth, so you can watch live there. And for stationary uh, solutions, we have our EFOIL Pro cabinet. Uh, it's a bigger one. We have it also for the 100 watt system and also for the 500 watt system. And it, the size is depending on the customer's needs. So it's up to four MT60, so very big if it's needed. And all our energy solutions are a plug and play solution. So the customer just has to connect his, uh, his um, load. And our um, company in uh, Canada, because they have uh, yeah, much stronger winters uh, than we have, they do energy solutions for ambient temperature down to minus 40 degrees and also Portable, so energy EFOIL Pro Energy Box and EFOIL Pro Trailer, very portable solutions, and stationary solutions, the EFOIL Pro Cabinets, and also for all our uh, different uh, fuel cells. But even if this is not enough for you, we have customized solutions. What does this mean? The customer doesn't request for us. Sometimes it's only a different connector because he has a special connector on his load sometimes bigger solar charge controllers, but sometimes we have to develop a complete new enclosure. So, as I said, completely built to the customer specification. A lot of the requests are for more autonomy, and this means we have, as example, more boxes where we can put in more fuel tanks. Yeah. And one example, one other, there we have two fuel cells inside because this is a an, um, an, uh, system for, for traffic management and there are two fuel cells inside. Same cabinet, same enclosure, but different application. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed it. Have a little bit of an uh, impression of our energy solutions. And we have uh, some on our uh, booth, it's uh, D45. There we have the EFA Pro Energy case. And also there we have a uh, robot, uh, which is uh, uh, where is a fuel cell integrated uh, in the robot, and it's for surveillance and for uh, shopping information, but yeah, with a camera on top, so you can watch him live at our booth. <laughs> Thank you very much, Patina Sinelka. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Are there any questions from the audience? <laughs> no? Okay, so you've mentioned here uh, 41,000 fuel 
uh, sells in the market. Where is this dis distributed? You mentioned you have in Canada, in the Netherlands, in Germany. No, the, the but the where is the focus? The fuel cells are, oh, oh where is this distributed? We are uh, distributed worldwide. Uh, we started, of course, in the German market and in Europe, but uh, nowadays we're really acting worldwide, and that's why we have a worldwide logistics for the methanol. Um, then I think that's all for the moment from my side. If you want to discuss the topic any further, please go to their booth, booth D45. It's in this direction. Uh, you can see some of their products as well as the robots. Uh, thank you very much again for your presentation. Thank you, too. Bye.